Right, here we go. We've got Undead with a TV advantage. Wonderful. Varvar -var Binks. He's got a 3 mighty blow. He's got a move up and an edge up and a dirty player and 13 men. So he's already got everything he needs. He's 10 and 0. Wonderful. Wonderful. <sighs> Wonderful. Yeah, exactly try. It's crazy, isn't it? I've never seen him not play ter I've never seen Unger not play terribly. So, I don't know how he gets the, all of these. Like, an ace qualified so many times for Chalice, hasn't he? And, like, he's about 75% win rate and stuff, like... It's just... It's crazy. It's, it's incomprehensible. It's a bit like... There was another one, wasn't there? The Necro guy. Do you remember the Necro guy? Um... Oh, that's not the wrong, that's the wrong thing. Oh, he's not in anymore. Aldrea, there you go, he's, he's just, he's just sneaking in. I've literally only seen Aldrea play terribly. <laughs> and yet, 71%. Like, it's crazy. Hello, Papa Piccolo. Scummed down TV again, after all that. There's not a lot of hope. He's 10 and on, he's scummed money, but you know, there's a chance. What do you mean there's hope for you to, to do well by playing crap? Is that what you were saying? There's hope, yeah, there's hope for everybody. Yeah, I mean they all they all do the they all they all do the blitz dodge out, don't they? <laughs> they all do the old blitz dodge out. So as long as you're doing that, you've got a chance. But it is weird, though, isn't it? Because like you'd think they just wouldn't have those records by playing the way they do. I never know what to do, by the way, setting up like this. Like, do you put hobos on, but they're more likely to go? Or well, they're less likely to go, but worse if they do go? I never know. Yeah, I meant Aldrea. <laughs> Aldrea was the one that came to mind, because he was just always qualifying. He's probably won, I think. I think he's won CCL once. Like, I think he's won the uh, playoffs once. Maybe not. I think he has. Maybe he's a woohoo boy. Jelly all salt. <laughs> ah, yes, yes. <laughs> this fucking meme. <laughs> oh no <laughs> they all every single Russian coach who alive looks exactly like uh, looks exactly like Jim from American Pie <laughs> well Chris does, and that's good enough for me. <laughs> I've got no idea, so no idea. Hey.
Yeah. There's a few that's decent, isn't there? Oh, good. Apparently, he's playing WoW and doing a degree or something. He's got to reroll that. Wow, he nearly. <laughs> he nearly turned over on a three dice with a reroll. Never lucky. <laughs> Both down, please. No. Both down there would have been could have been devastating with the stand ups and the blitz and everything. What's the best German food? Schnitzel, obviously. There are no stadium upgrades, no. God, uh, do you want to get banned? Uh, I don't understand that. I'm just going to ban you. And then... I've had I've had crow actually, but uh, I think it's uh, I think it's schnitzel. I like schnitzel. I like big schnitzel, and I can't deny. <laughs> opening here. Yeah, kebab's pretty good. Yeah, it's pretty German. G23, it was made in Germany. Döner is German. It was it was made in Germany by a Turkish man. But it's pretty German, yeah. Döner. I did not really like the Currywurst, to be honest. I was not a big fan of Currywurst. Some people would be, I guess. Well, I mean, the thing was, Dimi, Kislev were never in Blood Bowl, right? So. Yeah, it's like, it's just kind of like cheap and nasty, isn't it? A bit. It's not. It's alright for what it is, it's just a bit like. Just not. Good. Yeah, pranks to venge. Brexit, isn't it? Brexit means Brexit. Guard paying off wonderfully well on the bulls. <laughs> Cheap and nasty. Nothing like British ones. Oh my! Honestly, Dimmy, you'd be in heaven. You'd actually be in heaven. You, you like British kebabs, don't you? Oh my god! The German kebabs are like just fucking unreal. Unreal. <laughs> oh, he gets the one D pal. Look a dog. Oh. <laughs> 
which gets in the 2D bits, which gets in the car as well. Look at the guards in. There. But then he can't blitz, so I'd have to blitz without, without mighty blow, which, as we all know, is just the wrong thing to do. Derp, derp. Base, base, base. This won't fail. I am on the right. Burp, burp, burp. Burp, burp, burp. So that his gold pie is a disgrace. Bangers and mash. Oh, look at this stand firm doing things. Glorious. It's really annoying that Blizzard, you're often going to make the odd GFI with chores, dwarves of any variety really. Mince pies and then mince pies. Yeah, Christmas mince pies are pretty good. Going for the one on the hobble, of course it's a pal. My removal, why not? No. Glorious. Fail. Oh, 
Alright. It's the place to stick with Bull and two guys. Making break tackle away from them as well. Oh, well, done one guy. Could dodge there, and then 2D. It's one of 1D, but I'm gonna re-roll it. Oh, baby. La force d'un ours, mais hélas, les talents martiaux d'un compagnol. Could go there to 2D him. That's a bit risky. I don't really want to expose him. I guess I could 2D him and then go there and then 1D him. It's pretty risky though. Plus, isn't it? End the turn for fuck's sake! End the fucking turn, man! I mean, I could have, yeah, but that doesn't achieve anything. I'd rather hit him. I guess I could have followed and then 2 would him. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay, so the bull could have hit him and then followed. But I wanted to keep it. I wanted to keep the centre held. But yeah, that, that would have been an option, follow. I thought it was better hitting him. Because, like, this is where it's weakest, isn't it? So, hitting him breaks that up a bit. That's why I wouldn't have minded putting him into 1D the moment. Then, then on a knockdown, and that shows it all up a lot. Oh, 1D the mummy. He could have 1D the mummy, but he couldn't 2D the mummy. Then I would have had to re-roll. I wouldn't want to skull with, with the bow. And then I couldn't have hit this guy. So like there would have been a much worse fail fail state if I'd hit with that one day with the ball. He's still in a pickle, isn't he? Apart from getting to 2D with his money. How's this going? So that, that, that not having a third reroll costing us a claw 90 there. Because if I'd had three rerolls, I would have made the 1D with the ball, which would have pushed the mummy back and given us 2D with the claw 90. But I didn't want to do it without a reroll. It's 
just a pointless foul when you've got no other ideas. Make a foul and hope for the best. Cosmic. I guess that's how he's gone turn and all then, eh? It's pretty good. Just make loads of removals. Good. Brilliant. Woo! Got a great opportunity to defend with five players now. This should be interesting. Smoking doors. God, thank God there's no smoking doors anymore. If you want to be part of Team Positive, then uh, you've got to fucking suck it up. Stop bitching like a little baby and try and fucking play better, eh? Wonderful bit of adversity here. <laughs> Let's have a few more removals, please. Dead dwarf? No. Unbelievable. I thought for sure after using the apple the next turn would see a dead dwarf, but never mind. I don't even have enough players to 2D him now, do I? Oh, no, maybe. It's just about enough players to 2D the the money the, the mine at all money. I guess not if he fouls him up. This is a GFR. Gonna move in, and then move in. Might as well make the moves in first so there's something there.
force, comme on dit. C'est un rôle, un cap, que dis-je Une péninsule Well, ok, at least that was only a push. Like he's really lacking guard, isn't he? It would have been really nice to have been up there. So getting heavily outbashed by taking three cars. Maybe four. You know, I had claw mighty. I had claw mighty characters. Four cars. It's hard, isn't it, when you take four cars on your defensive drive? It's just hard. It's just a fucking hard game, isn't it, but... but. He's got no... He's got one guard on his entire team. Just couldn't. His teeth will Yeah, I'm concerned. Yep. Well, there's a chance, isn't there? He's got to get in range this turn. <laughs> You're going to GFI Mummy Blitz. That would be interesting, wouldn't it? Yep, give up sometimes, the classic. Yep, two off for the rest of the game. Nine men max. The second half. Two guns. The one advantage that I had. Gone. <laughs> it sure feels like it, Randolph, I always see. It sure feels like it.
temps à arrêter un halfling qui vient d'entendre la cloche du dîner. Soutien suffira-t-il à prendre le dessus Wow, so it's been well done. That's <laughs> the bit with the cheese. Fouling strats. Uh, no, it's just dicey, isn't it? Fouling strats are just dicey. Wow, he did this the worst possible way, didn't he? <laughs> oh, no, he's going to chain into an extra hit, except he didn't chain it. <laughs> so he's not... This is, he did the worst possible way. He could have just blitzed him and pushed him and then had a 3+. plus. But he gave himself a 4 plus 3+. Plus. Did that the worst possible way. 10 and 0. 10 and 0 and he did it the worst possible way. That is unbelievable. Oh, it's... It, I just... I just four, but still, it's a 3-2 instead of just a... Instead of just a uh, just a two, the big ones, the two GFIs in the snow, isn't it? Yeah, one at a time, mate. You might not try the next one if you fail. Fuck off. <laughs> Good. Deserve that for not stacking them. Honestly. Honestly, not stacking the GFIs. Reedy game. Oh, glorious! What a glorious block! Finally, Claude does something. Now he's a shit human team. Wonderful. Calcium. Good luck. <laughs> yep. God, there's a chance. That's his lone guard are out. Maybe make a removal. If make two removals on the LOS, then it's 9v9 and it's almost fair, isn't it? Apart from the fact he's got a wizard and Arch Force your hands recovery and starting with nine players but apart from all of that tell me there's a chance <laughs> yep <laughs> yep jelly -o. yep fucking joke in it
Imagine, je sais chanter. Oh non, par pitié. Vraiment oh oh eh, Pas la peine d'être méprisant. Coach personnel dit que j'ai une belle tessiture de bariton. Il s'acharne sur ce pauvre joueur. Wouh 9v10. Glorious. Voilà un qui est aux fraises. Un des fruits les plus mortels qui soit. Pourtant, son horrible goût devrait nous mettre en garde. 9 vs 9. Oh, baby. Claw actually doing things. I mean, not actually, but the Claw player is doing something. Glorious. Okay, that guy not. Alright. Glorious, 9v9. And he's down a mummy. Down one guard, down two guards, but down a strength five as well as down another guard. So there's briefly there's briefly some hope. <laughs> a brief moment of hope. <laughs> that sounds harsh, but it's true. <laughs> Oh god, that's it. <laughs> oh, was that night? That's a bit harsh here, yeah. that's a bit harsh here, yeah. It is the scared anti bolt move, yeah. Nothing wrong with that. Woo! Oh, ho, ho, the greed as well. I can't believe even the fucking brilliant coaching would have really liked I really like the brilliant coaching. Anyway. Sorry, hello, the night. <laughs> Did I say hello? Why do you say oi oi, are you bloody cockney or something? Oi oi, Savaloi. <laughs> Sorry, hello. <laughs> Right, hopefully it can Kaz is, uh, Kaz is white and then Kaz is girl. That would be wonderful, wouldn't it? That would actually be glorious. I could even eat the double skull on the blitz of the, of the white, but I'm not going <laughs> to. Not fucking gonna, I'm gonna reroll that on a dub skull. Come on, self removal, please. No. Come on, Kazim. Jim Shard. Il va se faire aider, cette espèce de d'assister. He is not threatening the wizard, is he? <laughs> <laughs> Do you think you'll fireball? I mean, there's six players there, isn't there? Five players there to fireball. Including three really good ones. I 
think it's bad fireball. I'll, I'll happily eat the fireball here. Like, I guess there's only nine players in the field and five of them are in the thing, so I guess it's not that bad. I guess it's not that bad. <laughs> it's more than half of the players on, on my team under the fireball. <laughs> so while he's got no play on the ball after it, um, just pushing in with everybody after would be pretty hard, wouldn't it? But I didn't think it was very good, but maybe it would have been decent actually. Thought his team was too far away to make, you know, good use of the pressure, but maybe not. And you think how few players there are. I really am trying to make VB9 a thing, aren't I? Yeah, it always seems to be nine players. <laughs> Always. Yeah, yeah. I mean, that's why. That's why I like. I didn't care about five orcs. I thought he's actually four miles away. But you never know, do you? Hey, go on, self removal. No, look a dog. The good old tree twat magnet here. Start getting forward, haven't I? Actually, but he's like over committing one side, then over committing the other side, isn't he? In return, so I was hoping to get something going. I guess it's hard shuffling around with movement four, isn't it? Oh, yeah, blitz the skinks. Well, that's what he's gone for. It's a removal. Instant removal. I mean, of course, mummies are the skinks for me, aren't they? Because uh, they're all armor seven, but it doesn't matter. Yeah, Jelly, one turn. And in comes a massive foul. <laughs> Fuck's sake. <laughs> no, I'm not dead. Out fucking rageous. Getting real hard to defend the ball now, isn't it? Just got no fucking players. Oh, hey, Wanger. I guess you could just blitz him.
Il transpire la faiblesse. Good God. You had to abandon the ball, didn't it? I mean, it's okay if he spends players fouling him. That's okay, isn't it? He could just get sent off and then boom, his turns. Tony looks like he wants to foul first. If he fouls first and he fails, then just everyone bezes down the field. It's amazing. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> if I'd put him down on my own on purpose, he had died. For no reason. In an otherwise entirely winnable game. Then <laughs> I could call it foul bait. <laughs> no, just no fucking players, it's horrible. He's already blitzed. <laughs> hey! Oh, it doesn't matter, he's got all the rewards. Huh. Excitement is short lived. <laughs> it turns into a yet another stun. <laughs> Hello. I think foul now is terrible. Absolutely terrible. Now the foul's okay. <laughs> but um <laughs> but if he'd fouled when it was just a break tackle dodge to hit his fucking edge four, I think it would have been completely and utterly horrendous. Come off it, man. No, I can't even tag. Doing anything. I have to GFI. I mean, I could have done that anyway. Right. I guess this is alright. <laughs> I guess this is alright. This two plus is better to do, isn't it? Because we feel that they're both down. C'était pas gagné d'éviter la chute. Guess just keep him occupied. Never get up. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's that thing I did about as well as I could do then. Thanks, Pedro. Yeah, I thought I was quite happy with that. I was quite happy with that, considering how <laughs> absolutely fucking horrible it was. Now, of course, he gives the chance by his previous turn, but still, quite happy with that. If he bolts the ball, he's got to deal with the ball. If he bolts one of the balls, he's still got to power the ball. <laughs> I 
Thanks, table leg. <laughs> Oh, he fails with a bolt! Glorious! Oh, he was bolting that guy. I think he tried to bolt that, this guy. I've looked where it was. And I guess that way he would have got 2D on the ball, was his thinking. But nice. Yeah, 2D him, and then he could have assisted and blitzed with the tackle. Not that, I mean, not that the tackle did anything, but he... And then he would have had the recovery as well. So pretty nice, actually. Pretty nice, bolting him. Good decision. Yeah, stand firm. Stand firm guard. And like, it was a good way to get two dice, wasn't it, around the back? I, I guess his other choice is just bolt him, and then he could just wander around the front. Like, that's what I would have done personally. I would have bolted this guy, and then wander around the front. But I guess by bolting him and then getting the push there, you blitz from the back, and then it pops out, and then you've only got a three plus without tackle, haven't you? With it, like without dodge, then you can go and get it there. But I guess he was thinking if he blitz from that direction, the recovery would be worse. I don't know. Yeah, that's so, there you go. He's failed the three plus so far. Hey. I mean, rolling the 2 plus was definitely the best move, wasn't it? <laughs> Succeeding the 2 plus was definitely the best. Joking me! These fucking indestructible ghouls. Fuck off. <laughs> right, this zombie isn't doing fuck all now, is he? Whereas he could just get lucky here by... Uh, I guess he could just tag. But he could get real lucky here by sucking off actions. <laughs> yeah, boy. <laughs> if only there was some tackle and some mighty blow to deal with these ghouls. <laughs> <laughs> he should be out of rerolls now as well, shouldn't he? Because of the bloody, but the bloody, but for the uh, brilliant coaching. <laughs> Brutal grace. Hello, Harlequin Solitaire. Yeah, so he didn't he didn't eat actions. Maybe I should have just tagged the ghoul. To put But then it doesn't really matter if you stop. The ghoul could just roll to three plus and then they're both three in. At least this way someone had to use an action. Wow, Arthur. <laughs> that is impressively bad player. <laughs> you've got to try. You've got to roll better than that, Arthur. 
Bad, bad play. And he should be now re rolls! Motherfucker! He didn't follow! Wow, wow, we were. No, I guess yeah, it doesn't run because I've still got two plus one. But then, how do I give it to him? It's the question. So there's no one on him, is there? So he's able to blitz. Oh, he's he's standing. What the fuck? I didn't know he was standing. Hmm. Hmm. Well, he's got to tackle the free. <laughs> Just got a straight two D with him. I've just got to dodge away and get, let him hit without a tackle, I guess. Go here. One, two, three. Oh yeah. Okay, so they the screen now. One, two, three. So he's got to go one, two, three, four, five, six. Double GFI. Okay, I guess that's good enough. Close, he didn't do terribly. He didn't do terribly, he nearly got there. Yeah, that's actually, that's actually a good place to fall, isn't it? Yeah, because now he's got to go all the way around. Yes, he's got to hit without tackle. So he's at least got to hit without tackle. And he's 30% to get us down. And if he doesn't, it should be an easy tutty. Doesn't do it. Glorious. <laughs> Plim plom plu. Autopiloting the optimal <laughs> for, yeah. I didn't even think of it, but yeah, it's totally right, isn't it? Oh, he's a great player, he's a great square to block, actually.
Well, if this is a two plus. I mean, I, it, it should be. It would be just a two plus, right? One, two, three, four, five, six is, is all it should take. So that's just literally pushing him and then pushing him. And then there's a blitz as well. So he could blitz to get his assist in. Well, he could push that and I can't push that way. Okay, so he's got to push this way. And I guess I could tag him and push him. And then blitz one, two, three, four, five, and then 2D him. Doesn't make any sense. Oh shit, do I have to fall here? It just needs a push, doesn't it? Basically. Okay, I guess I could try and blitz him. But then that takes a square anyway, doesn't it? So it's just a 2 plus with a reroll. Any chain push? Maybe. It wasn't easy. My guys are so slow. I don't think there was going to be. I don't think that was going to be anything easy than just a 2 plus with a reroll. Glorious. Heh, <laughs> look <her. laughs> Amazing. Absolutely amazing. <laughs> it is standard, isn't it? That other one, that other one with the fucking the three four. The whole game came down with I couldn't make a three, and you, you did a four. That was amazing. This was pretty good. Dear me, he has got the uh, move eight, but hopefully he won't know how have the foggiest clue how to make a one turn. Commiseration, Tom T, keeping the record alive. Yeah, thanks, thanks, Dio. <laughs> oh dear, brilliant. <laughs> well, thank you, M. Sandwich. <laughs> there you go. All right. Oh fuck off. <laughs> oh no. Oh no! No, no, Mac no unconcerned. I thought it was McNaughton then. No unconcerned elf. <laughs> no, I can't. I can't do that. <sighs> Fucking riot! Dio, do you know which absolute shithead stopped us getting the uh, the uh, upgrades to stop riots? <laughs> Do you know what absolutely horrific, horrendous human being thought it was a good idea to stop us, uh, to stop us stopping riot? Do you have any clue, Dale? Oh, he is the lead admin, isn't he? What a bastard! What a bastard, J Five, doing that to us. I've already been fucked by a riot on this team. Here, here goes another one. <laughs> And he hasn't got a reroll, so. You know, it could fail. Not dead? Wonderful. Always a success when a. <laughs> when a chorf somehow survives being blocked. <laughs> You'd think they'd have better odds of surviving death, wouldn't you, being armor 9? But no.
Definitely, yeah, he's the super admin, Pedro. J5 is the super admin. <sighs> the thing is, though, you joke, Jelly Old, but he, he probably will, won't he? Like, there's not a lot he has to do. Could base the ball, but again, he just dodges around too. Yeah, the only good thing is the no rerolls. So that puts tackle on him for power. And even a push is pretty good. To stand up the chauffe, achieve anything? Maybe, I guess. He's got no rerolls. Should have been back there. I guess he could have. He could have won. He could have failed the block there, couldn't he? Could have dub skulled or just rolled pushes and then one in nine. But he just rolled the power. Three three to score. On appelle ça le baiser des Nefel. I guess it make lets him make pointless blocks. So it's got that going for us. So yeah. No, two threes. <laughs> Got the looker in before I left. Fuck me. Thanks, Frank Fur, it is, isn't it? Still on the still on ten toes. <laughs> oh, God man, that's so annoying. <sighs> Dodges were incredible at least. And the bolt. 28, 29, 25. Sterling block dice, really. 33, 21, 37. <laughs> yeah, it's t twice though. T it's two two wins lost to Rye. Two like kind of against the against the odds wins, just fucked by Rye. It's kind of annoying, isn't it? There you go. Five two one. What's that? That's six wins to one loss. Like that's not a bad. That's not a bad win rate, is it? Six wins, one loss. It's not bad. No, wait, wait a minute, no it's not. It's 30 wins and 10 losses. Oh, it's terrible. 
Yeah, oh, that's totally wrong. 5-2, it's 6 wins and 2 losses, isn't it? It's terrible. Oh, shit. It's 30-0-10. Oh, God. Oh, God. Right, thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.